The aim here is to embed a link to our new user create script into our CRM menu, but along the way, we'll improve the CRM menu itself with some new styles. So open the file in htdocs in the CSS folder, alpha crm.css. Scroll to the very end, and on the last line, paste the snippet from project CSS CSS update 8.8. .8. This adds some new styles that will make our CRM menu more readable. Save that, close it, and open the snippet project includes ink CRM menu update 8.8, .8, which tells us that it's an update in the documentation, and save this as in the includes folder double click ink CRM menu and check yes overwrite so we're overwriting the entire file with a completely new version this new version provides our menu links as before but restricting the company create company edit and company people edit forms to a user level with access of 21 or more that is editor it adds in a further menu link to the user create script that we've just created but restricts access to a user level of 99 that is an administrator and alongside the bottom horizontal menu which was previously just our logout link it adds a further three links to folders under our htdocs folder now we certainly don't want any old user having access to folders so we restrict the access to the administrator only that is an access level of greater than or equal to 99. as we've saved that we can proceed straight to our browser and open the home page of our local host server and you notice straight away there's a new link create new user which we expect and there's additional items in the horizontal menu at the bottom apart from logout there's the list of folders which we can look at we have to use the back button to go back to the home page the links also take on the styles of the new styles in our style sheet the .css file our create new user link which is available only to the administrator allows us to create a new user by entering a password let's enter infinite skills with a password of fred3 retype the password thread3 and give it an access level of registered user and click save it tells us that a new user was successfully added and allows us only to quit to the home page if we try to create a new user again called infinite skills with the same details it tells us that this failed because there is a duplicate entry infinite skills for the key name username if we log out and log in as registered user we'll find that the only options we have are to list the companies or to log out I hope you can see from the process flow in this lesson that we certainly need to create a user list from which we can manage all the users and this is left as the main exercise for this chapter